Hey, hey, hey! Welcome to my channel, everyone! I am the Global Chair, and today we'll be playing Dying Light 2. Before we begin, subscribe, like the video, and enjoy the show. <laughs> oh, that zombie is glitching! Screw this! How do I activate this mod? Oh, that looks so dope. Oh, Marco was over here all along. Great. Another water thief. Just what I need. No water thief, just the pilgrim. I'll be out of business soon. You sell poisoned water. I'm here, because a guy named Julian claims you sold him poisoned water. I didn't poison anything. All right? Uh, Julian claims otherwise. Sure. Listen to the guy who sold me flour mixed with plaster. Wait, what? He You're did that? How are you with infected? I need to get rid of those things that are down there. Oh, I just finished them off. Wait, Aiden, we're supposed to take care of them? Did they just respawn? Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Oh! Oh! Stay away from me! Oh! Jeez! Who just added 13 infected below here? I remember I cleared this out earlier. Do you deliberately poison the water to kill the band? But someone else got the water instead. Not quite. At least uh, I didn't mean to. A, a while ago, I killed this viral that came crawling in here. And the fucker fell straight into a tub. The whole tub fucking ruined. Oh, a viral fell into the water. Why don't I teach these bastards a lesson? So I filled some bottles with the zombie water sent them out where they'd be easy to see just don't tell anybody i'd be ruined marco i can't lie to them julian is gonna hang because of you just be honest and tell your story to the bazaar it was an accident even i'll defend you no one would buy even a drop of water from me. you can change your trade i won't let julian hang for something he didn't do fuck julian i got my own skin to save Maybe switch factions? So that's a story you ain't going to tell. So this is a story that I won't tell, huh? Let's go! Whoa! All right, let's go! Marco Polo! Aiden, your stamina is weak as hell. Okay, we're finally done with Marco. Bonk. Got a taste for city life yet. Oh yeah, the city's yeah, been great. There. there hasn't been a single species that doesn't want to kill me. Oh. Bevan's husband is dead. Julian's been accused of murdering him by poisoning his water. Aiden, please, tell them it was- I don't think it was him though. The water from the supplier was tainted. Julian is innocent. A viral fell into his supplier's storage tub. The guy drunkenly sold Julian contaminated water. It wasn't a murder. You'd swear to that before the Bazaar Council? Uh, yes. Yeah. Where's that supplier? He's going to stand trial in- Marco... <laughs> is dead. I... I killed him. And I don't want to end up drinking my old pee. Oh my god, it's you! Hey, you're a better climber than one crazy girl I used to know. How many women did you meet? She even wanted to climb the tallest building in the city. The VNC Tower. Oh, can we go there? She's one of your wives. <laughs> Too hot-tempered, even for my tastes. And what about this passage to the center? Right. Look, from this roof, you can clearly see the Peacekeeper's base. That's the Peacekeeper's base. The PK are your ticket to the center. I told you the only way to get there is through the metro tunnels. I'll go inside and draw their attention away from the platform. Then you enter the metro technical station. Oh, that's, that's our plan. There. We'll take it together to the central loop. <sighs> he sleeps really well. Is that a bolter? I haven't seen before. Probably a bolter. You can find some interesting stuff on them. But catching one requires serious hunting skills. Now is not the best time for this, Aiden. No, I want to catch the bolter. There are no howlers in here, right? <laughs> oh, that's a lot of them. Maybe there's something I can use. Okay, that was a bad plan. Oh! <laughs> Oh, this is nuts! Oh, come on! 
Okay, we have to head down the metro tunnels in three minutes or else we're going to turn and that's not a good thing. I have to hurry. Gosh. I'm in the tunnel. Okay. Now watch out for the infected. There might be a few or a few dozen. I'm already in the PK base. Okay, Aiden, you have to be quiet for this. The zombie walking around is my problem. I have to make my way carefully across the metro tunnels. Oh, come on! I never expected this mission to be very intense. Shh, shh. Yeah, good. Yes, I restored my UV light. The technical tunnel to the main station should be well lit. I've already lured the guards upstairs. I'll chat them up while you get inside. Whoa! Shit. Oh, it's a spitter! Devious things! I guess these monsters think puking on my clothes is okay. The radio signal isn't working. Okay, bam. Why do I have to lockpick my way out? So they're still discovering the murder of their commander. Is that why they keep harassing the survivors? They think the survivors killed their commander? Damn. Hey, what are you doing here? Oh no! It looks like the peacekeepers found us. Where did he come from? He was wandering from the skies Fucking from millions bizarre, of Richard. miles away. More like a renegade spy. Do I look like a renegade to you? Look like a renegade. Oh, this is interesting. So the peacekeepers captured us. Ah, oh, so this is what it's like to be in your camp. I kind of feel like a prisoner. What were you doing at our base? I'm only trying to get to the city center. The center? <laughs> the tunnel's gonna be closed until you hand over Lucas's killers. Bizarre scum. It hasn't been long since I've been here. How is it that you lot saw nothing, heard nothing, and you managed to forget about the ban on passage? Maybe we'll start punishing you by cutting off your hands. That would improve your memory, huh? Okay, you're giving me a bad impression of the PKs. Four days ago, I was a hundred kilometers away. Enough, Anderson. We need the truth, and you won't get it through coercion. What kind of interrogation system is this? Command. The tunnel will be closed until I find our commander's murderer, Commander Lucas. His body was found in the bazaar, horribly mutilated. Oh. The people of the bazaar aren't making this easy. They're proud and loyal. I refuse to turn anyone in. But what makes you Commander think it's someone from the bazaar? Patience. You have a lot Wait of built-up anger towards the Lucas bazaar. had a weapon. A rare set of brass knuckles called the Lazarus. Can I keep it? This is the key to finding the killer. If I find the Lazarus, can I keep it? What about the Lazarus? Tell me, we are your only chance. If you want to get to the center, that is. So, will you help me? I can try. I have no loyalty towards one faction. So if I find that weapon, you'll let me through to the center? Their camp kind of gives me a GRE vibe. First one through, once justice is done. How will I know that you'll keep if her I have word? No other choice. I'll try. Whoa, this is the PK base. They didn't hurt you, kid, did they? No, they didn't. I mean, Anderson threatened to chop my hands off. So, what did they want from you? Ader asked me to help him. Ader said he might let me through to the center, if I help him. I'm gonna trust Hakon. What are you supposed to help him with? He wants me to find Lucas's weapon, the Lazarus. Went missing from the crime scene. And he believes finding it will help find the killer. The Lazarus, huh? Fancy set of brass knuckles, right? I mean, it could be used as an effective weapon. Goods and other shit he gets from thieves. A fence? Part-time fence, full-time scammer. 
An artless one. Too. An artless scammer. The city after him for death, right? Okay, where is he? If anyone in Villador is fool enough to buy a peacekeeper weapon, it would be him. And what's his name? Hubert Cabatos. Hubert. Also known as Half Ass Hubie. <laughs> Say he sets up shop in the nearby windmill and waits for customers. Poor guy, he has to be stuck with that nickname. If you want to find the Lazarus, talk with Hubie. I'll chase down some other leads. Are you half-assed Hubie? Hey, Hubie, you got a special customer. It's that pilgrim from the bazaar. Wait. I just oh, he's running away from me. So that was Hubie, wasn't it? That was suspicious. Yeah. Apparently, he had an urgent appointment with another. Well, I'm gonna chase him. Let's go. Yeah, sure. Hack on. He's running away. Hubert, come back. Like Hubie. Oh, wait a sec. I see him. I was running to the north. I got it. <laughs> Hubie, where are you going? We barely know each other. You almost got him. Oh, Hubert couldn't have run that fast. Aiden, you're so slow. Come on, let's go! Use your parkour powers for good! Hack on. He's not here. I lost him, where is he? I saw him right there. That little weasel must be hiding. Look around. Oh wait, I see him. Where is he? Climbing. See that GRE building? He's climbing to the roof. You have to run far from here, haven't you? I'm looking for the Lazarus. Yeah, I used to belong to Lucas, the late PK commander. Hey, don't try to tell me you don't know who Lucas is. Yeah, if you tell me that, I know you're lying. Know and I don't like liars. Are you kidding me? Even if I'd been offered those brass knuckles, I would have refused. I'm not an idiot. <laughs> that weapon is way too hot. Okay, at least you're not half fast as I thought. How do you know the Lazarus is a set of brass knuckles? I never described the weapon. How did you know the Lazarus is a set of brass knuckles, hmm? I didn't say that. Come on, everyone knew about Lucas's little love glove. He was always showing it off. If anyone thought I had him, they might also think I killed Lucas, which is bullshit. Yeah, but someone tried to sell it to you, right? Who tried to sell it to you? you I... Okay, fine. Maybe so. You better tell me. I can't say who. Client confidentiality. Stop fucking around. Tell me or I- I have an infamous history dealing with NPCs. I met her in the tenement building at Meatpacking Square, near the old butcher shop. But I don't know anything else. Leave me alone! Okay, I can deal with that. Hubert said someone tried to sell him the Lazarus. Do you know Amaya? No. Strange, because I thought I knew all the women here. Hack on, stop. Let's activate our first windmill. Oh, this is exciting. I guess pilgrims are engineers too. Okay, let's go look for a Lazarus thief. <laughs> Okay, we got one of these bandits. Oh, this is gonna be fun. <laughs> oh! Oh, these bandits are jerks. Okay, we took care of him. You're so fun. It looks like our bandits were stashing the good stuff. Okay, now where is that girl, Maya? It sounds like a kid is getting choked up there. What's going on? The Lazarus is mine now, so give me the Lazarus. Maya, I need that weapon. It's very important. You expect me to just hand that brass Hoosie what's it over? Are you nuts? The Hoosie what's it's real name is the Lazarus, and it belonged to an important PK. We might have a war if I don't return. Yeah, do you want them to burn your bazaar to the ground? Okay, I'll give you this stupid thing. But for 500. Ugh. I can give you 10, and that's my last offer. Deal. Nobody wanted to buy it anyway. I have this really exciting idea for a new fragrance. What's the new idea? I have fortune for just a whiff. Ooh. I called it. Turn me on. Oh! I found the Lazarus. Now get me to the center. I did what you wanted. It's your turn. Get me to the center. Opening the tunnel to the central loop is beyond my pay grade, Pilgrim. Command wants me to find the- You promised! Ader, you promised! Cool down, Pilgrim. I keep my promises. First, 
Take this. Token of gratitude. Oh, what is that? Ader, I have to get to the center. Get it? You're looking for someone, right? Yeah, I'm looking for somebody. The central loop too. My wife and kids are there, and I can't protect them when I'm stuck here. The tunnel will open when I find the killer. Is that clear? I guess that's fair. PK and the bazaar really hate each other. Why can't they just work together? Only two people matter at the bazaar. One is that overblown preacher, Carl. I know that. Who else is there? Sophie, his right hand. She has a way with the bazaar's more rebellious souls. Helps him keep control. I guess I'll go see Sophie. Roger, a local gangster. He knows what's going on, and about the bandits led by Joe. But they're afraid of the PK. Well, I know who I'm questioning next. Is that PK harassing that survivor? I don't know what brings you here, but watch your back, Pilgrim. And stay away from the PKs. They ain't no one's friends. What a jerk. This time with a biomarker. Sophie, can we talk? Don't hurt him, Herman. Let him talk. I wasn't expecting this greeting. The survivors are nice people. They tried to hang me and then they tried to choke me. You're that pilgrim that came to town recently. You're sure well informed. Don't have much of a choice. I'm in charge of safety here. Besides, yesterday you made quite an entrance. I'm looking for a job. Would you happen to know of any? Hmm. People here say you can be useful. I'd rather see for myself. How about a small errand first? Uh, what are you proposing? Go to one of the craftmasters. Alberto or Vincenzo. Both know the location of the purest crystals. The location of the I purest need crystals. For a certain transaction. Oh, I don't trust this guy. We need the juice to turn on the UVs. Get on top and activate the windmill, will ya? It looks like they hate UV light. <laughs> Also, this is how they burn. Uh oh. Whoa! This is the revenant! That is all for today. If you enjoyed the video, please make sure to subscribe, like the video, share the video, and turn on post notifications, especially if you want another episode of Dying Light 2. Thank you for watching, and that's all. Mm -hmm.